this feel good right here. My name is Deanna Zundi and I own Dark Horse Espresso Bar. We keep popping, we gon' do what we do and keep popping. Haters try to bring you down. I think it's a good idea for people to, to have a general idea of what they're looking for, and if they don't, then just to ask and not to be afraid, obviously. Um, I do think that if you have no clue and you stand there and sort of look at the menu of the first time, you could be slowing down other people, but everybody's open to suggestions so sometimes it's nice to go up and ask the barista make you something that's their favorite and that's totally acceptable you don't roll up the rim to win <laughs> i think the great thing about a cafe is that it is somewhat of an extension of people's home office that's great i think i would say probably it's a good idea to put a cap on the amount of time maybe spend two to four hours and order something every two hours. The phone. <laughs> okay, when people are on their phone, on their, on their cell phone while they're ordering, uh, it's a bit difficult. Even other customers don't really appreciate it. I think it's a good idea just to tell your friend, hold on, order your beverage, and then go back to your conversation. And to keep the level somewhat um, normal, like at the same level of the rest of the room, not necessarily blaring above or, or listening to like YouTube videos on your computer at l loud volume when there's music in the, in the cafe for that atmosphere. <laughs> no porn in the cafe. <laughs> we should treat the barista like we would a bartender. So if you feel that you would normally tip a bartender, tip the barista, they're the same. They're even more skilled often because they have a lot to learn before they can get to the point where they can make you the beverage at the quality and, and the design and everything that we want them to. So I would say that it's a really nice thing to just, even if it's a couple of cents or a quarter or whatever, but just not to forget that they are in the service industry and they're working hard to serve you. <laughs> no porn in the cafe.